um, is called the achotillo fruit. It's um, native to Asia, but it does grow here in Ecuador and Costa Rica and Colombia and places like that. Brandon is going to be our taste tester. He's going to eat this fuzzy looking achatillo fruit and let us know what they taste like. And show you how to open them up the way the locals do it. Okay. Well, just like that, you just grab the skin and pull it off, and inside is this white looking. Just like that, it's really simple. How weird looking. This white looking piece of fruit, and when you eat it, it's like a piece of rubber, but it's sweet like candy. And you don't chew it, you don't swallow it, you just kind of suck the juice out of it. Because you can't chew it, you can't. Well, it's a piece of rubber. It's like a oh, piece of rubber how? from a car tire. How strange! Okay. But it's really sweet, like a piece of candy. Okay, so it's sweet like a piece of candy, but you can only suck on it and chew it like a piece of candy. But it doesn't break up or anything. Well, it stays completely whole. Oh, Look. that's strange. Ah, hmm. oh, that's There's after little, chewing it. There is okay. a little seed in the middle. Alrighty then. Interesting. Did you want the other one? No, no, I don't. I don't think so. I'll let you go ahead and try the next one too. Yeah, they're really good. You can get about a 15, 10 to 20 for a dollar. You know, depending 10 on to how 20 good you for can, a dollar. Depending okay. on how good you bargain. Okay. I wonder if they have any good vitamins and minerals in them. Huh, okay. Well, anything else you want to say about those fruits? Go buy some. Well, where can they get them in North America? A uh, chitillo fruit. In North America? Yeah. I don't think they can. Okay. Didn't think so either. I've never seen these anywhere. They sell them all over. Downtown, in the wheelbarrows, you know, like they do grapes and cherries. Mm -hmm. Or if you're in Libra, they're all over the place. From the window, yeah. Okay. So how about it? All right, well thanks Brandon for telling us all about that fruit. Mm -hmm.